What's up everybody kid and right here. So things seems to be looking good for Huawei now since it's getting some major relief from different brands. Well if you don't know, Huawei is currently unable to manufacture its high silicon chips and the company has to look to other providers such as MediaTek, Samsung, Qualcomm etc. And today a report from China finally claimed that Qualcomm has already received a license to supply Huawei chipset which is an amazing news for Huawei. But they have a condition. Well, according to the report, Qualcomm will supply Huawei chipsets if Huawei sell off its honor brand. The reason behind this is that Qualcomm won't be able to meet the demand of both brands at the same time. Like they can't manage to supply chipsets to both companies. But it's not a huge issue for Huawei though because they are already selling honor brand. So I think Qualcomm will start supplying chipsets to Huawei but right now there is no confirmation from Huawei about it that they will work with Qualcomm or not because TSMC also got the license to supply their old Karen chipsets so it's on Huawei now to choose one from these two. But there are chances that Huawei and Qualcomm will work together and definitely destroy the market. Anyway, this information comes from a report from China and neither Huawei or nor Qualcomm have confirmed whether the information is correct but Qualcomm selling off processes to Huawei is a good news. It's more like a rumor for now but the idea is something I really wanted to happen. But take this with a pinch of salt until it gets official. Well, Donald Trump the ex-president of the United States is now officially gone. He was the one who made some of the huge harsh policies for Chinese companies working in the United States, especially for Huawei, ZTE and TikTok. And now that he left the White House, Huawei fans around the globe are now wondering what will happen with those restrictions that Trump had made in the past. Well, the new president is Joe Biden, who is a pretty nice guy and according to some sources, he is widely expected to improve diplomatic ties with China and tone down the harsh policies used by the Trump administrations. But he can't make some of the huge decisions right now. It will take time but he will definitely take action to remove these restrictions. With that being said, right now he didn't said a word about the trade ban which is going but we can hope for the best. Anyway, I will cover every single news regarding that. So make sure to hit the subscribe button to get notified. What do you think about it? Then let me know your thoughts on that in the comments down below. And as always, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out. <laughs>